so blessed that we have the two talented guests on our show, Tim and Eric from the Tim and Eric Awesome Great Show. And we want to find out how they became famous so people out in TV land can become One, good comedians two, like three, them. One, two, three, four. Come over here, Eric. We want to find out about both of you. Oh, boy. It looks like we got an earthquake in here. Okay. We want to know how you got into acting and and what... Okay. Let me know when I can introduce you all. Okay. Let me know when we can start introducing you. Looks like we're having a disco dance now. Okay, we are so blessed by the powers that be that we have the talented Tim and Eric Awesome with us today, and we want to learn how they became famous comedians. Let us know when you're ready so we can introduce you. to be that we have the talented Tim and Eric with us. Do you want to tell David, us? David, I'd like to introduce my partner, Eric Wareheim. Uh, well, it's good to see you. It's good to have you a part, uh, a part of the show, show. I want to know how you both comedians got started in the entertainment business. You all have been a comedian since the Carol Burnett show. And, 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 and I like how you all can go into different characters. And uh, we, we, um, how did you all get started <laughs> into the entertainment business? <laughs> Well, you got the giggles. <laughs> well, you got the goofies. Okay, how did you become a comedian, and how did you both meet first? Well, the best answer I could give you would be that um, in the beginning, Eric and I developed a technique called the tickle technique. And oh. that involves getting together with a friend and tickling each other as hard as we can. And it, we begin every writing session by by tickling each other. A tickling? Well, that's interesting. Yeah. Now, how did you all meet, and how did you all get into doing your first comedy shows together? Well, Rick and I were be uh, we're in a tickle group uh, in college, and if you, if anyone remembers college um, being in tickle groups, I got a tickle. And I went over to Eric and I introduced myself and I said, I would like to try tickling you. And wow, he accepted. A, wow. Okay, uh, now. Oh now, my God, I got a tickle. Now, when did you get your big break? <laughs> um, the first time. Oh my God, I got a tickle. We met. Wait, 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 oh wait, my God, I got a tickle. Well, let's hold it for a while. Oh yeah. my God, I got a tickle. Let's hold it for oh a while. Oh my God, I got a tickle. Let's ho oh oh my God, I got a tickle. 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 Oh my god, I tickle. Oh my god, I got a 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 tickle. Okay, now, now I want to know how did you get your break and how did you get discovered? Because your show is better than a lot of the new situation comedies that are coming out. I'd like to know how you, you, you all first got on TV. Who discovered you on TV when you first did TV? Oh, I said to myself, we want to be on TV, Charlie. But my friend A said, I got to get a tickle going, honey. I oh. want to be TV, but I got to get a tickle on me. 
Oh wow! So never. what? So I want to know how did you um, how did you all do your what was the first break that you all got before uh, before you did Tim goes to the mayor. What did you do before you did Tim goes to the mayor? You want to tell me what you did before you did Tim goes to the mayor? What that got you your first big break? We're so honored today to have two talented comedians with us. Tim and Eric. Okay. You want to tell us um, um, how you first got into Hollywood and how you first got your break on the, uh, with Cartoon Network so we can encourage other people to become actors and actresses? Pennsylvania. My daddy's from Norristown, uh, Pennsylvania. Eric, I would love to play a, a game called What Is That I Hear? What Is That I Hear? I'm going to play a little bit of riff and, I'll, and Tim will say, I hear blank. I hear the sound of a vacuum cleaner. Right. And a vacuum goes, <laughs> we'll practice one. Okay. I hear the sound of a vacuum cleaner. I hear the sound of a dust broom. I hear the sound of a motorboat. I hear the sound of a child crying. <laughs> I hear the sound of a man thinking. I hear the sound of a dog playing. <laughs> I hear the song of a a tin ton too. Don't do 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 do. I hear the sound of a sad man. The sounds I hear every day of the week. These are the sounds I hear every day of the week. I hear a man drive, hear a child playing. I hear a tin ton tom. I hear a grass being mowed, leaves being blowed. That's the sounds that I hear today. I want a taco in my mouth. A taco in my mouth. Tacos and tacos for lunch today. Eric. Tacos in my mouth. He said tacos in his mouth. David, do you like tacos? I oh, like tacos with mushrooms. I want to talk to you, Eric, about Madonna. Yes. I know you're a fan. I'm a huge fan, not only of her acting, but her music. But talk to me a little bit, because you've spent some time with her. Yeah. What's it like? The producer, Madonna the producer. Girl, Madonna the producer is truly an innovative woman. Uh -huh. um, she takes a lot of her creative energy from Guy Ritchie okay. and people like Sean Penn, the men in her life uh -huh. that have kind of inspired uh -huh. her uh -huh. to lay out a business uh -huh. plan uh -huh. and to, to kind of promote different aspects of her life, <laughs> not just the new videos that are great and uh -huh. she looks good. Uh -huh. She's lost a lot of weight and that just kind of amps up 
her energy to kind of self-promote herself and make is her some Italian? wonderful producers. What is it? What is this rumor I've been hearing about a new record? Is it? <laughs> is it out of? It's wild. Uh, Madonna <laughs> sent me a couple MP3s okay. and it is off the charts. It stands. Uh -huh. It is. Britney Spears on acid. It is so much fun to listen to. It's going to be a hit in the clubs. You're going to love it too. Now I've I've heard some of her older material, and I'm going way back now. Right. Like a virgin. Like a virgin. Material um, girl. Material girl. <laughs> uh, even some of her more recent right. stuff. Last night I, I dreamt of, of San Pedro. Pedro. Everybody's going for the Latinos. What about us Americans? Tell me a little bit about Enrique Iglesias, who you spent the weekend with. Enrique is a wonderful guy. He's so giving. Mm -hmm. uh, we spent a weekend uh, in his island off of Spain, and he had some wonderful food. He showed me some of his new okay. movies he's doing. Well, thank you for that. Okay. You're welcome. I want to know what high school you all went to. And you ought to have a street named after t your, yourself since you became a famous comedian in America. <laughs> Everything I know from my mind, I didn't go to school. He didn't go. I learned everything I need to know from my mind. You're very creative, and a lot of people can learn to be good comedians from you. Because the new stuff on the TV is junk, but your stuff is original and good, too. David, why don't we show a clip of the new season of The Awesome That's Show? That's a great idea. Uh, let them show a, a clip of the new Awesome Show. A uh, new season of a Tim and Eric Awesome Show, November 18th, on Adult Swim. Let's go to a clip. Now, an introduction to the Svengali deck. The Svengali deck has been around for plenty of years, and it's one of the most popular trick decks of all time. There are plenty of tricks you can do with it. We're going to learn a whole bunch right here today. The Svengali deck. The secret method of the Svengali deck and the handling. The Svengali deck compromises of... 26 cards, all being the same. Ladies and gentlemen, let In me introduce case, 26 from the left of corner of the screen every other card one of the of great diamond. talents of our time. Mixed in with these you can diamonds, cut the tape, ladies and gentlemen, because here we go with Mr. Rick and Dick Rick. Hi, Mr. Rick and Dick Rick. I think you could be such a wonderful man. I think you could be such a terrific man if you had. His name is Eric Lairheim. What a special sandman. Oh, 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 oh. He's a sandman. Thank you, Tim. I would like to take this time to just thank you for years of friendship and using all of your creative energy to help with the videos that we make. Yeah. To help mold them and make them make them interesting for people to watch. <laughs> I just want to take this time and thank you so much for all those things. I want to uh, counter and thank the heck out of you for just about every moment of the day <coughs> of the day. Well, well, I, I appreciate that. I want to thank you all for hiring me on the Tim and Eric show. I've had a lot of fun on there. I would like to take this time to introduce a real good friend of mine. His name. Tim Heidecker.
Should I sit? Oh, right over there is fine. Sit? Right over here, right over here, so you so you don't fall down. Right there. Okay. Oh, Where is right. my chair? Oh, right, it's right here. What? Right here. Right here. <sighs> right here. Oh, careful! Right there is fine. Oh, right, 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 right there is fine. Where? Right here. Right, right here. Right, right, there, right there. Right How's there. How's this? Oh yeah, that's fine. Oh, right, 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 right here. Right, right here, right here. Right here is fine. Okay. Oh, we want to thanks for having me, David. We want to congratulate you for getting married this year. Hey! He has a beautiful <laughs> French wife from Canada now. Okay. I want to thank you for doing my show. I want to thank you for doing the show. I hope you call us back to me on more of your shows. Build! Chuff! Hughes! Fage, clasp, nost, vest, chalk. What language is that? Shorm, bilsk, take, jach, vins. What language is that? What kind of language is that? Is that alien talk? Yeah, what kind of language is that? I've never heard this in my kind of language. Is that Martian talk? I'd like to know how Can you, you pass first... Me guitar, please? Now what? Oh, yes. Have fun again. Let us know what you want us to do. You're the best thing since the Smothers Brothers.
What's the name of that song? What's the name of that song? Five more minutes into the show. <laughs> 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 Thank music? you for coming to my show. Okay, uh, well, well, I hope you come back. Thank you again. for coming. We all come to back my to my show. Will you be coming back to visit us Thank again? you for coming to my, to my show today. Thank you for coming. To my show today. Thank you for coming to my show. Thank you for coming to my show. Thank you for coming to my show. To my show! Thank you for coming 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 to my show. Thank you for coming.